Well, hello everyone, this is of course your host, the Owlhead, and welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. We have... Okay, first, first, before I get ahead of myself, go to the Embark screen. We check on the missions. Who do we want to throw into the path of destruction here? Restraining padlock from minus stress. 25% uh, on... Oh, minus stress transformations. That's pretty cool, actually. How about our regular missions? We got a long medium mission for a martyr seal, which is honestly not that great. We have a blood charm for a short mission in the cove. Let me let me think about it here. Who could we stand to level up on a short mission real quick? Like who would benefit most from that? Probably low stare. That's my bad. Um, Ellers. Uh, we will take Ellers. I think. Does he have the attacks that I want him to have? He does not have hue. I think it might behoove us to take that, but before I get out of out of control here, hmm, maybe I could switch these two up. Yeah. And then for our third position, who else are we gonna take? Let's take me, I think. And do we have a single healer? A healer, do I hear a healer? It does not appear to be so, but we could take Corbin, who's got Battlefield Bandage 2. That's something, and I think that's going to do that. Now that we've got our decided upon people, let's also check the guild out real quick. Let's uh, drop Ellers in here. I want to give him Hugh Part 2, and then, um, yeah, we can change it up from there. Uh, is there anyone I can put in the blacksmith to upgrade their stuff? I mean, if I had the chance and the time, I'm gonna upgrade his armor now. While it, uh, while we have the opportunity, Arendelle's already upgraded. Corbon, are you upgraded armor and... No, neither. So, let's put you in there. Put you both of those things, because the cove is rough, man. I'm aware that the cove is rough. And I think from here, this is going to be our crew for this next mission here in the cove, and we're going to embark. I think that would be for the best. I'm fine, quit asking. Yeah! Low stairs, fine. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? So, for the cove, take two shovels, take two keys, a single medicinal urban extra bandage, and a buttload of food. Wow, we've taken all the food. Maybe less food. 12 should be fine. It's a short mission. And I'll take 10 torches. Just because I don't wanna I don't wanna rush it. You know? You never know exactly how much you're gonna need. I think it's better to oversupply than undersupply, because undersupply could cause a slight case of death. By the way, how's everyone doing? I'm still dealing with my cold, not much. But a little bit, you know, like it's... The smell of rotting fish is almost unbearable. That's like I'm at work. I'm actually feeling fine, all things considered. Yesterday I was so tired. Have you ever had that where you're just like, gee, I feel like crap for no apparent reason? Let's open this. There's still booty inside. I'm always up for some booty. And, and some booty. Paid for in blood. There are jokes there. I just woke up about, okay, I woke up like three hours ago, you know what I mean. I didn't wake up too long ago. Aaron Delta Grave Robber has no trinkets. That was legit pretty dumb of me. Come on, man. Bro. It's my turn. I've got some fast units. Let them attack already. We're going to go with Harvest and try to get rid of these two. Oh, yes, and some bleed. So that's working out fine, I think. Spear pushing. Cool. They're doing a lot. They're hitting harder than I would have thought. We can heal for three, though, so that's pretty good. Oh, we can't heal ourselves. Shit. That's troublesome. We'll start there. And we'll just give uh, Corbin lots of food if we have to. Um, oh, shit. I didn't... Uh, I didn't use his Huey. either. So we'll get rid of you. Destroy them all. This is not impossible, though, so let's... You think flashing daggers? 
Um, we can only use them in the back position. We could buff ourselves, and I think that would work just fine. This guy will be dead in his next turn, and if that's the case, we can battle ballad. What, everybody? Oh, I didn't realize. That's actually super easy. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. So I can't use it on myself? That sucks. Um, we'll just do some fire, You gotta get rid of the back guy. Ah! Oh, man, Corbin's just taking it right now. Not pleasant, but we did bring food. And even we got a little extra food from that chest, so... Oh, wonderful hit. Very good. Sellers. We're gonna have to name some of these new units after some people. I'm sure I'll think of something. Well, it's only four damage, but it's, it's not actually so bad. We can go right to uh, Slice Off, I believe. Some bleed? Yeah, we got some bleed. This guy is on his way out. So actually, Intimidate is fine. Give them no good order. enough. We'll take all the food. We'll be feeding Corbin, like, three food here. We'll definitely use this key, and we get... A whole bunch of crests. Cool, cool. Fair enough. Where do we go from here? I guess if we're exploring 90% of rooms, we go... Well, we have to go down, don't we? We don't have a choice. Ah, that's why Another you bring an extra shovel. Another misfortune. That's a weird short hallway. Normally it takes longer than that. Oh, good! A sea maggot or some sort of slug. That's just fantastic. Um... Give ourselves extra dodge and speed, but I think it would probably be wise to just jump in. Yeah, yeah. Should have looked at her attacks a little bit while I had the chance. I think we'll start harvest and get lots of bleed in. Should have used battlefield ballot, and we will up ourselves while we have the opportunity. That should really help out. Can we take him out? I hope so. Ah, five. You dick! Get away from my Jester! Get away from my me! Sea Breeze, huh? Heal for 11. That's actually a really good heal. Crazy good. Barnacle Barrier, huh? So you're protecting the slug. I wonder what he does. Brine. Which is... Resisted. Oh, it's a debuff with a small attack. That's weird. Stress Wave. Oh boy, here we go. Where do we start? I mean, I guess we just start where we're at, huh? Get the attacks in. Pirandel, not hitting quite as hard as I would like, to be honest with you. Let's buff our targets. For all the things that it upgrades their accuracy as well. Actually, that makes him super uh, useful for this character right here. Um, we could intimidate, but instead I'm just gonna try to get the attack in. And then sniper shot as well. Or he's got Hardly any health left, come on. We gotta get him out of here before he gets healed. Brian again, huh? You're really trying for that debuff. Minus 20 dodge is pretty bad. Okay, that's the end of that unit, which is good, because he was scary looking. Stress wave again. Boy, for a short mission, this is looking to be unpleasant. Don't kill my damn archer. Alright, let's do... Think Intimidate? Yeah. We need some more variety of units. We need, like... Hmm. Or I could do this. Yeah, let's do this. A little more bleed. He's almost dead. And from here, we can heal other units, but not ourselves, which is great. Um... Let's just attack this guy back here for seven. That's not... Brian, you're gonna try Brian on the Jester, huh? No such luck with the debuff. That's beautiful. That's exactly how you want that to go. And then from here, uh, we can just buff as much as possible. Really wish I could use metal for advantage on myself. The fact that I can't is extremely frustrating. 
because otherwise you've just got tons of damage happening. What is this thing's protect? 75% protect? No wonder. Okay, well, I think we battle ballot again, and then I'll move the grave robber back. Yeah? I'll move you back here so you can do some attacks. Okay. Um, you've still got some accuracy and crits. Confidence is there we go. It's the enemy dead. Crumbles. That is helpful. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Yeah, I know. You've mentioned. Thank you, Wayne June. Very helpful. So that's definitely another battle. Well, we can go down here and then just explore the rest, I guess? Or, I mean, there's almost no reason not to. Oh no. We're not uh, we're not taking everybody's uh, light down because somebody here is gonna freak out in the party, I'm betting you. If it gets too dark. And then we'll just pop one more because why the hell not? How you guys doing? Are you enjoying Darkest Dungeon on the channel? It's always an important question to ask, but one I sometimes forget about. All of the deep. Probably not great. So you're buffing him now for 25% damage. Okay. Okay. Um, we can't do Battle Ballad now. That sucks a whole lot, so... Decisive yeah, bleed. let's get some bleed in if we can. Ah, uh, Spirit Vision. Corbin's gonna end up dying. I'm betting you. Alright, we'll lunge to put ourselves back where we were. And I think it would be for the best. Oh, the crit! The crit is so good. Gur, you bled on my best coat. Um, chop. Could we get the kill? Yes, we could! Oh, yes. So, the priest is guarding him. Okay, okay. That's okay, though, because poor damage. Just not hitting as hard as I need you to. Oh, he's guarding the... Oh, I get it now. You can only do toxin trickery. I guess we have to move back a little, don't we? Fair enough. Okay, we can do Harvest or Slice Off. Or bat Let's do Battle Ballad for now. I think would be the, the correct tactical procedure here. And then what? Does this extra damage for marked foes? So let's mark... Oh, we can only mark the guy in the back. Hmm. We could just do a good old Fire a little bit of damage for everybody. Octosastus, not great. We got some real rookie uh, units here. It's not doing quite as much as I'd like. It's only four damage. He's also buffed for an extra 25% protect, which is not great. He's already got 58, so no wonder we're not doing much damage. All right, from here, we'll just do regular attacks, I suppose. Fine, we also got a debuff for him, which is good. I guess we'll battle ballot again? I think I could have set the uh, the attacks and stuff up a little better. That's a nice solid hit for 8 damage. <coughs> Octo says this again, but we got to dodge thanks to battle ballot. Okay. We could do mark. We could do mark of this enemy, which is helpful. And then, maybe just bleed out, or <laughs> we can make it completely impossible to hit anyone. And just have, like, unlimited speed and evade, plus crit. The damage is a start, and then from here, maybe we'll get rid of this guy? Yeah, that's good, that's how you do that. I can't believe I completely forgot to add trinkets. It's like it's my first time here. And a sniper shot to finish it off. That was pretty good. It was decent. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious, insidious killer. killer. Is it? Boy, I didn't actually think this would be as damage heavy as it even ended up being. Let's eat two food just for a little extra health there. Without no, we didn't mean to clean it by hand. Must rely on oh, that was stupid. And that was really purpose. stupid. My brain just was like, yeah, click. Oh, 
This is what happens when I'm out of coffee. Oh man, okay, hold on here a second. Is there anything I can turn off and on? I can turn off and on any of his attacks, actually. So if that's the case, let's get rid of Finale and give him Dirk Stab. Yeah? Or Inspiring Tune. He doesn't have any kind of a heal, just a bunch of debuffs and buffs. Still, so, yeah, we'll give him Dirk Stab even though it moves him around, which is not my favorite. And, oh, we can change his stuff up. So we'll get rid of poison darts and give her shadow fade which will move her back yeah this makes her a much more useful unit so we'll do it that way I think would be best I think so I'm, I'm hoping didn't find many trinkets either I was kinda hoping we would stumble into one got quite a while to go. This ended up being a much larger, short, size mission than I thought it would be. Game, can you not creepy sound effects in my brain because my ears are right here and I can hear everything you're doing? Hopefully the worst is behind us, I guess. I can, I can hope for that much. We've got a trap coming up in this hallway. Do not walk directly into the trap. I know it's there. It's right there. Look at it. There it is. Good. Disarm. Disarm is good. I mean, eerie coral? Something eerie about this coral, is there? Can we bandage it? No, item had no effect. You know what? Mess with it. Coral is soothing to the mind. Minus 10 stress. Excellent. I didn't know what the hell to do with it. I don't know what might help, but... Creepy, uh, creepy ruins in the background. Very Lovecraftian. I guess we go up this hallway and then back around? We kind of have to. We've gone everywhere else. Uh, actually, looking at the map, we probably could have left the one room alone. That's fine. Though. Got good track record so far. Mess with it. Nothing here at all. That's also fine. How about this box? Mess with that. We contain stashed heirlooms. Cool, I guess. No problem. Okay. There was nothing in here. All right then. That was a waste of torches. It's fine. It's fine. We got two more rooms to go to. And I'm starting to think maybe just this once, Rose, everybody lives. Uh, map. And proceed. Oh, I walked right into it. Every time. Ancient traps lie yeah. in wait. Traps lie in wait. Thirsting, thirsting for blood. blood. That was, it was, I like, I saw it too late. I was like, oh wait, there's a thing in here, isn't there? We walked right into it. We much, must keep our courage up despite this weakness. I'm right, people should listen to me, but they usually don't. I think I just have one of those faces. No, not the shocker. Do not give me the shocker. Although good, uh, good on you guys for attacking the support unit. Actually, I actually think flashing daggers would be a good idea this time. You're attacking our grave digger. Luckily, they can actually uh, please resist it. Very good. Resist the stun. All right. Shop revenge. I still haven't. Okay. Let's just try this. Yeah, we got one down. It's only a matter of time now. Let's do battlefield damage to heal the grave digger for four. That's good. We could almost use camping at this point. Let's go for huge. Or, uh, harvest, rather. Flashing daggers again, good. Yeah, there we go. Only one dude left. That's what I'm talking about. Leave my damn archer alone. She's having a rough day, man, I tell you. Get rid of this guy. Executed with impunity. I want him dead. I want his family dead. I want his house burnt to the ground. Dogs outside are barking. Yes, I've seen the movie The Untouchables. It hasn't. Hey, we explored 90% of rooms. You know what, guys? Let's get the fuck out of here, because the cove was kicking our ass. Despite its morbid aspect, this twisted cavernous maze seems almost traversable. Yeah, I, I still think the cove sucks. The cove is real difficult. The damage they can do is pretty bad. 
Corbin's now a kleptomaniac and a wheeled adventurer, and I am a lurker. I am kind of a lurker. I've been told I give off the lurky vibe. It's probably because I'm tall. Let the organ notes ring out from the Abbey. The sisters are gathering. And that means what exactly? Like, are they gone for the... They're still here. They're still in the roster as far as I can tell. Right? Yeah, no, they're they're totally fine. Did we get extra experience? I don't believe so. It doesn't look like it. Or may, no, they uh, they received they uh, relieved all their stress. Oh, that's cool. I just want to check the stagecoach real quick, and we don't get any new units that we haven't already seen or any extra cool units. So that's definitely gonna do it, I think. Pop Corbin here for a drink. Bring the whole bottle. This will not be a short night, but this will be a short episode because that's going to do it, guys. So you know what? If you enjoyed that, leave a like. If you'd like to see more Darkest Dungeon on the channel, hit subscribe. This next time, I think we may be going for this boss battle over here. So you know what, guys? This is your host, the Alhat, saying I will see you next time.